What's going on? Welcome back to Real World Tool Reviews. And I wanted to do a quick little review of this Occidental Leather tool pouch. This is the 4-in-1, I believe is what it's called, tool pouch. Um, and I've been using it. I got it for kind of a different purpose than what I've been using it for. But what it's turned into is my little pouch to put on when I'm building something. Um, like if you're a DIY type of guy, you know, you, you own a house or you fix up rental houses or you just, you build a lot of shelves out of two by fours and plywood or you build, you, you're going to build a deck or something. I think this is an awesome pouch to have. And I've been really happy with it since I got it. And I'll show kind of what I keep in here. Um, it came with this tool shield. Um, and it goes inside of here. I just don't use the tool shield. I just, for me, I like... I like it without it better because it, it just it takes up without with my tape measure in there especially it just it makes it to where the tape measure doesn't want to fit as well the tool shield is cool though it has that you can put a pencil in there or something and you can put a chisel in here or a fixed blade utility knife so that is a feature of this that I don't want to leave out but I don't like it so I might put it in a different tool bag because it is a good little thing to put something sharp down in. But I like it like this. So it fits your classic like Stanley Powerlock 25 foot. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. And then, you know, so it's got your, your tape measure. And then what I keep is a pair of pliers. And... A utility knife um, and you just have to find the tools that slide in there and fit in there good you know it's leather it'll move a little bit and kind of form to what you use but um, it's got a good sturdy clip on it and you can put that through your belt the loop but uh, if you just want to have something on you to have like a I use this flathead to just pry like you know staples and stuff out or or whatever um you need a little screwdriver or something this loop fits stuff like that good you got to find one that works but this one fit in it perfect and this is really how it's been rolling for me uh just a little carpenter's pencil fits right here in that pocket perfect so what i have found that i love is to have this on my on my belt and you know when you're cutting a lot of, of two by fours or whatever cutting a bunch of lumber say you're building a big shelf or something like that's what I was doing this weekend and I just have this on my on my hip and you know pull out my tape measure whenever I need to measure make my mark you know whatever works out perfect Throw this back on there, and then you know you're you're building stuff like what I was doing. I was building shelves in my attic, so and I was kind of building them off of the off of the rafters and stuff, and so I was kind of prying staples off of the you know old stuff to make room for where I was going to screw these pieces of wood onto the rafters, and I was using these pliers. These are my Nipex twin grips and these have found a home in this pouch i kind of struggled looking for where these would live but uh they're great for like grabbing and pulling stuff and twisting stuff pulling out nails uh pulling out staples grabbing uh you know stripped out screws i actually i always manage to strip out some screws some screws uh with my impact driver or something and i'll you know twist them out with that with that edge, that end there, but these are just good all purpose pliers and they fit in here really good. So if you get this pouch, you need to get some tools, you know, look around, find the ones that fit. 
And uh, I love having a utility knife, but in order to fit it in there, I needed to find a smooth, um, you know, retractable utility knife. And this one did the trick. This is a just a you know regular old Stanley. Um, it's really smooth and nice. Slides down in there perfect. USA made one. So this is an awesome configuration right here. So I just wanted to do a quick little video showing an awesome little pouch. I've been loving this pouch. It's the 5523. That's the part number. Occidental leather. It is just a, a really handy little pouch. And uh, I got it a little while ago. I, I did a video on it. And uh, I, I said I'd let you guys know how it was working out. And the only thing that I want to maybe upgrade about this, now that I'm looking at it, is it's a beautiful Made in the USA Occidental pouch, right? And it's got a Stanley Made in the USA tape measure. It's got a Stanley Made in the USA utility knife. It's got a Stanley made in the USA flathead screwdriver, but it's got a German pair of pliers. I don't know how I feel about that. As much as I love this German pair of pliers, I might, I just might have to get a Stanley pair of little slip joint pliers to go in there. I don't have any. But I do have others. Maybe a uh, maybe a nice pair of diamond made in the USA. But the thing about this, well, that'll fit in there. So that would make it maybe a little more vintage, but. These are really not as good as these. So, sorry, Diamond. Maybe if I find a good uh, a replacement for this that's, um, you know, acceptable, maybe I'll put it in there. But I think maybe there can be one German tool in there with the classic Made in the USA Stanley tools. So, anyway... I'm getting a little off topic. <laughs> I'm letting my OCD kick in. This is just a really good little tool pouch. Really good for if you do a lot of like handyman work um, where you're where you're marking boards, cutting. Um, you know, you have this on your belt. You got a, a speed square close by. You know, you got your saw horses out. You, you pull this off. You know, you get that, you make your mark, you know, get your speed square, boom. This is all right on you. Put it all up and you're ready to make your cuts, you know. It's just a, it's a great thing. And then when you get there to put it all together, you know, you need to pry something. You do that real quick, put that back. You need to grab something and pull it out or bend it or you find a little bolt that you have to grab hold of and turn or something. Um, you can do that. And you're always, always, always going to need to cut something real quick, you know, cut some caulk, whatever you got to do. So really a, a sweet little kit that I have really enjoyed. Really, really enjoyed this. So, uh, I would highly recommend it if you do a lot of a lot of cutting and marking and assembling of you know all kinds of wooden stuff. So, anyway, that's a quick little Occidental leather fifty-five twenty-three four-in-one uh, tool pouch. Thanks for watching.